viewers and welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun the Lost Age. In the last episode, we defeated Orochi and saved the town of Zupang. Wait. No. The serpent. Izuma. Same difference, really, in terms of plot. But anyway. In this episode, we shall be doing some bonus stuff that we can actually do with San now. First, we have to refix this because, uh, someone broke this up. Wow, it's really fun. There's something in stone, it's back in its original position. How did this happen? The Fusa and Kushinada must have moved it when I wasn't looking. Yeah, someone moved it. Because it was... Doing. Now then, climb down here. Wow, this is some massive lag. Climb down here. We get to the Izumo ruins. Now, you can't get through here without sand, because when you try getting through here with the normal way, <laughs> you have to break down one of those two things, and you have to jump across them, and you can't jump across them to break them down. So, yeah, you have to go through the sand, and you can't get through the other side like Down 
sniff, sniff. I smell fresh milk. Ha ha ha, you're going to give me that milk, are you? Huh, huh, huh. I'll trade you this for it. Fuck myself. Can we get a little turtle? Or a little turtle? I don't know. I don't know why the, the uh, you know, friend uh, foster there. Anyway. Now, we take this little turtle. All over here. So, I will cut it and meet you there, Vera. It's better. And we're back. Hi, Vera. It's told you I'd go over here. Now, here is where the trading side quest finishes. Oh, I forgot to mention something before. That mace that we got in the guy's cave sucks balls. Anyway. Guy rocking. Whatever. Anyway. Let's go find that thing. We have to get over there. Can we get over there anywhere else? Well, we have to run through this house, actually. Not really through it, just around it. And down south. And up this I'm so very sad, man. I wish I had a friend to call my own. You can give him the little turtle. Hey, you got a big bottle of water. to a little island in the middle of the ocean. Hmm. Well, here we are. If you want to go back to the island, just let me know. And here is the Islet Cave. In this first part, there are no enemies, which is incredibly lucky because, well, at this point right here, you need a synergy to get past. But we don't have set synergy, so we can't do anything. Else. We get turbo boots. I like safety boots. Oh, they're on me too, but they're easy. Ha 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 ha. I got lucky and every time I was playing the game with my own, I suppose. But anyway, I digress. Our destination is to get that thing at the top there. Yours. To what's his face? 
all the way in y'all. Yeah, that's pretty far we can go actually. But, well, there's something I have to do on the way. So, I will need to recommend this that I have to do after I get the thing. Oh, big whoop. That's my gun. Wow, I am, I am shocked. That was just so funny. Hey, right Dead? Now then, you have to cast Mind Reach Gas. You all set to go back to the island? Yep. And he takes us back. We can always talk to him to come back and forth between here and there. Here we are. You wanna go back to my secret spot again? Alright, Virus, I will meet you at the spot where I have to be. Showing off. Thank you, Virus. Hello, Virus, and we're back at Apogee Islands, yes. Uh, before I continue on, that was from the staff that we got in the Islet Cave, and it's really good. Anyway, continuing on. Now then, to get to where we have to go, we have to go to a certain spot and cast sand. I believe it's right here. Yep, sand. Go out over here and follow this path onwards. To victory! Anyway, from here we slide down here. It doesn't look like you can, but you can. Now walk in there, and we enter the Apogee Islands Cave. Which is a very small though. See, very small. No, actually we have to go through a certain, uh, one of these pathways. So we're going to be casting Whirlwind Blast. Trying to get the right spell going. There we go. Whirlwind! Nope, not that one. This one. Yes, this is the right one. Hey. I think there's two pathways, but this one's the right one. And here we get... Well... A Dijin we don't have to fight for once. Oh, it's been a while. We get Haze, which, in battle, allows you to become a ninja. Now with this, this is saying that they want you to come here first, uh, go get sand first before you got, uh, Parch. Obviously because you get Wii's at the, is it Tower? Which is weird, but okay, we'll go with that. But anyway... The next plot is going to be very, very long. I need to find my way out of here, that'll help. Go this way. There we go. It's kind of like Flash. Alright, viewers. Yes, this will be the end of the episode. I know it's a very short episode, but it's mostly side stuff, and the actual plot is going to take a while. Later, viewers. Why not? Anyway, have a good day.